Hi, my name's Helen and this is my channel, Helen Mary Jo. If you're new here, then welcome. If you're returning, thank you. And if you're a Hell's Bell, hello. I, um, this video is like long overdue. Honestly, I don't know whether I'm on my head or my tail at the moment. And that's a polite way of putting it. Um, I wanted to show you today. So I'm not going to do everything I'm going to wear because you literally would be bored witless. But I thought I'd show you a few of my other kinds of hopefully um, planned outfits. When I say hopefully, because I kind of don't know what other people are going to be wearing. So, you know, you don't look like a Charlie, do you? Um, so I'm going to show you some, some of, a few kind of evening looks that I've got and a few daytime looks that I've got. And I'm going to pair them with some of Meneer's jewellery. I'm obviously spoilt for choice here. I've got um, two of my own Meneer necklaces on already. I do love layering them up. That's quite a trend these days. And I've got on my little matching pearl earrings that they're all mine. Um, but you can see I've got this beautiful long necklace. I've got this um, smoky quartz, I think it is. I've got the delicate crystal got the dark pearl I mean honestly so many beautiful things I mean I'm kind of hoping that I can find a way of showing you all of these things but obviously if I can't I can't I mean you know I'm not going to do it just for the sake of it I am going to actually try and pair up what um, I'm wearing with some of these beautiful pieces of jewellery this is the Helen Mary Jo collection I can't even believe I'm saying that and um, all of the necklaces will have um, a little HMJ tag on, as will the little um, heart bracelet and um, this other beautiful pearl. And uh, I think that's an amethyst. Gosh, they're going to be so cross with me. I try and remember, and then I literally, it goes um, in one ear and just out of the other ear. I, I, I think my brain's full. Last night, Rob and I were watching uh, Ma Michael McIntyre spin the wheel, wheel, and he was a bit appalled that I didn't know how old the planet Earth was, but I did know that Elton John was Romeo, Bro uh, Romeo, or was it Brooklyn Beckham's uh, godfather? Anyway, there we are. Different strokes for different folks. So, um, with the earrings, you know, I've got the two large hoops in gold and silver uh, oh i've got pop upstairs actually because i wanted to show you the evening bags that i've got two i've got and then i've got a selection of um pearls and then i've got a couple of interchangeable drops for the um for the paper clip chain so um yeah i guess i'll crack on with that and um thank you all so much for for all your kindness with the other videos that I've done lately um the cooking one was good fun and the dinner was absolutely yummy so I mean happy days I got to film what I was just doing normally and didn't have to keep taking my clothes off <sighs> funnily enough no I didn't have to take my clothes off while I was cooking the dinner and um what else was I going to tell you oh good lord see what I mean I literally thought oh I must tell them that um, I'm nearly at 14,000 subscribers, which is unbelievable, like literally unbelievable. So thank you. And if you haven't subscribed, could you just help? I think I need 20, 28 people to get me up to 14,000. Oh, I've got a bit of tinnitus. Where's that come from? Don't all tell me. Don't, don't tell me. That pain in my, my stomach, whatever it was, has gone. So um, I didn't see a doctor. I don't kind of want to start any investigations just before I go on holiday. Obviously, I would have seen a doctor if I had needed to, but um, I didn't need to. It just, uh, you know, my mum always says it'll get worse or it'll get better, and it got better. So I think it was probably just a bowel issue. Let's leave it there. Beautiful day today. The weather in this country is so bonkers, isn't it? It was freezing cold yesterday, and now it's absolutely gorgeous. And uh, Rob's out walking Dolly, and uh, hopefully I can get this done 
while they are out so I don't have to contend with that and if I remember what it was I was going to tell you obviously I will tell you about it later so as I say let's have a look at this jewellery I'm looking forward to actually pairing it with the dresses and um, I've got a couple of separates to show you as well from next and then hopefully I'm done with next I mean honestly Katie's just moved house and so she's been ordering loads of curtains their clearance sale is beyond brilliant I have to tell you and um, the shoe situation has just got worse which I honestly I don't know what to do about that and this morning I put my lips liner on and then I, I whacked on a a gloss thing out of the drawer and it 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 must be one of those um sting your lips jobbies because it's like Ooh. anyway I'm rambling on I will go and try I'll do the evening stuff first get that out of the way and then I'll do some daytime bits if you're interested keep tuned if you're not go for a walk that's probably not the right thing to say I'll see you in a second cheers so um my regular ladies will know that this is one of uh, the dresses that I picked up in the next sale which I, I do really like it's um it's it's like a cheesecloth cotton with a gold thread through it so it's it's kind of dressy but not too dressy and I've got what I was wearing already on with it and um I don't know if anything would be better a kind of times like this I almost wish you could uh talk to me I guess that's where a life comes in but that might be just too complicated I think that this might look quite nice mightn't it this uh seed pearl baroque pearl before I do that I'm just going to show you my hang on, let's put that up my choice of evening bags and as usual there's a story so I saw um these evening bags on the John Lewis site and they were well reduced uh, of course <laughs> obviously and um and then they were giving me a five pound voucher if i if i bought anything so i thought oh yeah i'll buy one of those and then i bought something else just to really get the free delivery and so but when i took took the other thing back the jumper back they don't then take the five pounds off the thing that you bought. They only take it proportionately off the two items. So I said, but that was like a gift. So she said, well, that's not how it works. So I was really annoyed. And I said, okay, I'll refund the whole lot then. So I refunded the whole lot. And then I went and had a look at the bags and they were reduced down again. So in actual fact, I got them for less than I would have done if they'd have given me the five pounds off and they had all the trouble of taking them back re-delivering these so I got I got these two Ted Baker just little pouches they're as light as a feather which is obviously what I'm looking at and I've got the gold and I've got the silver so I thought that kind of covers all bases really and believe it or not these were 45 pounds and then they were reduced down to 17 pounds I mean it's just completely um empty pouch but you know all I need of an evening really is my phone um, and a lipstick they I don't know if I said they're Ted Baker and as I say they're 45 pounds I mean it's not much more than a glorified makeup bag is it really I mean you could use it as a makeup bag but for my purposes I thought it kind of covers off and as I say they're so light you know dead flat dead easy so there's those two and then I also picked this up in the next sale and I'm in two minds about this really but um, I thought it's quite sweet. It's this little black sequin bag. And this was reduced from, I can't remember, but about £30. And I got it for £12.50. And you can have it, well, I've kind of cheated and made that so that it's just short for over my shoulder. Or you could have it, if you so required... And again, it's just for it's just for a phone and lipstick, really. You could have it as a as a little short crossbody. 
which I think is um, quite quite the thing at the moment. Just check my mic is working. Yeah, don't want that to happen again. So anyway, I don't know whether I need this as well as these two, but it is a little bit different, isn't it? The handle makes it quite heavy. That's the thing. I mean, obviously, I've got loads of bags upstairs. But let's not dwell on that. So I will take off. I'll take off this pearl. Not sure if um, the other pearl. This might be where I need Rob now because of uh, fastening these. But I'll see. Um, so it's so sweet. Look at the. You see the little decoration on there. It probably this necklace is the chain's probably too fine to put on with this paper clip, but you don't know, do you? There's only one way to find out, and that is to pop them on. Now, let's see. Well, I find it's either the first time lucky or I can't get it done. Oh, there we go. Well, I kind of quite like that because it's like the juxtaposition of the two two things but let me let me take this like chunkier one off and see i mean this isn't a dressy 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 dress can i say dressy any more times and i'll take these out and i'll put the um shell pearls in i'm doing it as quick as i can i don't know if i'd be better to stop the camera and do it but I'm kind of just doing what I'd be doing on my own. You can always fast forward it. Oh, while I'm on that subject, and I, you know, I, I don't gain anything by this at all, but I just wanted to tell you, I know that some of you get ir irritated by the adverts, and I too used to get really irritated by the adverts. So I pay for premium now, which isn't cheap as far as the subscription goes, but I watch a lot of YouTube, and I found that I was watching more and more YouTube and it roughly works out of 50p a day for a month. I think it's 14 99 and it makes the whole experience so much nicer. So, you know, if you can afford it, it might be a consideration if they do annoy you. Um, so that looks quite nice, doesn't it? I put on the rose gold shoes. And obviously with this dress, I would say that the gold is going to be the one. Um, and I will just go back here. What do you think? I think that looks rather nice, actually. It's quite sophisticated, doesn't it? If I say so myself. Yeah, I like that. I really like that a lot, actually. And I think with the gold, it just kind of gives it that gold. But it's not, you know, too much. So it's a really nice, cool dress for an evening and it, it and if like I was somewhere that was more relaxed I'd just wear it with flat shoes flat gold shoes or you know sandals or whatever so I think I think I really like that I'm just gonna oh, I'm taking my life in my hands now trying on more than one of these fiddly class when no one's here I did quite well with that one Just see if I can get this little dainty one on. These ones are easier because the, the links are bigger. There is no incoming call. That's Alexa talking to me for no reason. So not with these earrings, but I could put this on it, this little enhancer. Oh. <laughs> oh lordy lordy i like that a lot anyway gosh i've taken too long on this one right um i'll crack on sorry
Do you ladies remember this dress from the monsoon sale? Um, it's lovely, all different shades of blue, and it has got purple in there. I hate the colour purple. It's the only colour I really detest, scarred from my days at Heathrow. But um, it's a really lovely dress, and I thought I'd save some time and put this on. I've put on this, um, I'm not sure what that, I think that's an amethyst, but it's kind of got like almost a blue tone to it. And I put on these gold uh, earrings, because this is gold. It, I don't know if it looks gold on the camera, but in real life, is it gold? Yeah, I think it's it's kind of um, a pewtery gold. So I think you could go either metal, really. So because um, I put gold jewellery, I'll go gold again. Um, but it, I think I think it looks really nice. It's got that cheeky hole in the back. Um, this is definitely, I think, definitely um, a cruise. Um, Go to dinner dress but it's lovely lovely and cool needs a bit of a steam up it's got a bit wrinkly but uh it's quite flattering um yeah it's i like you know it's got a lot of detail i see monsoon are having another sale actually i'm a bit worried about monsoon because they're having another sale already i think today they're taking another 10 percent off their sale and when companies do that, it only means one thing, really. So I hope they're not going the same way. Um, so uh, if I can do this quickly, I'm going to just try. I've got this very delicate little um, silver necklace. I wear both metals. I know some people, like one of my daughters only wears white and the other one only wears yellow because um, their skin tones are really, really different. Funny, isn't it? Same DNA, but very different. I am just going to pop on these hoops, which I absolutely love. Um, this might not work, but there's literally only one way to find out. I, I kind of like them being hidden in my hair, if you know what I mean. Um, so I don't think I've joined the gypsies. I'm, I, I'm getting it on for... But I, I really like those a lot. And then I've got this delicious little heart with the the blue stones, which is rather cute. Not really a word you can apply to me, but um let's see if I can get that on. Oh, doing well today. So. So I don't think it works with these earrings, to be fair. I think the earrings are kind of more dramatic, but I've got loads of silver or white gold earrings upstairs. And uh, I do like that. Oh, you know, the other thing, oh, God, I've got to quickly, if there's any such thing as quickly, pop on the, um, the dark pearl. I don't know what this is called. This has got a heavier chain. Isn't that lovely? I have got earrings actually in that colour, like, I don't know if they're called black pearls. I don't know what they're called really. I'm not a jewellery expert, never claimed to be. I just love it. That works better, doesn't it? Yeah. Let's see. Let's go silver. I just have to have a silver bag here. Yeah, I like that. Hmm. I have got silver shoes that I could pop on, but, you know, we're talking about the jewellery for mostly today. So, um, I don't know is the short answer. I think I prefer, I think I prefer this combo with the... Um, with the earrings no doubt you'll all let me know <laughs> i appreciate it so that's number two i need to get a wiggle on this this video is going to go on forever i think i'm gonna have to do this in two parts so evening and day i don't think i've shown you this dress before um it was again from the next sale and it's that um oh god i can't remember something and roses 
whatever that make is from the next sale but it's a lovely um lace dress you can see nice detail i can't actually get it done up i mean it does do up but you know these stupid invisible zips you need to be a flipping contortionist don't you to get these on so yeah i shouldn't speak bad of rob should i because i need him right now anyway you'll just have to i can, i mean it's not that it's too small it's just the invisible zip kind of that angle so it's a lovely dress i think um and <clears throat> i kept this on because it is in the blue hues again um i wonder could i double up with this lariat which i also love i don't know if there's too much going on with the lace and everything it doesn't help that it's not sitting in the right place does it, it doesn't help that my microphone's decided to escape I don't know, I've got a little mirror here because last time it was a bit of a pain, wasn't it? I don't know, I do quite like that actually. Kind of elongates the body, doesn't it? So I'm going to walk backwards. Oh, hang on, take her handbag, Helen. So it's lovely, isn't it? Loads of room, loads of... Uh, accommodation for food so i'll have to i'll have to kind of wear my dresses the ones that are a bit less forgiving at the beginning of the holiday and these towards the end of the holiday but um i quite like that you know i think it's interesting or maybe maybe if i took took this one off And put this one on oh by the way my sister kathy that you saw in the bra video she is now in india and said that the bra was so comfortable on the on the long flight that she didn't even kind of know she had it on really so that's good feedback isn't it i might actually get one of those for my flight to bali Do you know when we booked the holiday i'm so ignorant i didn't realize how far away bali was a long way in it um not sure i mean what's really good about this is that i will watch the video and decide so i think that looks a bit messy it's interesting isn't it i suppose i could just take that off and just have the lariat right i'll just do this and then i'll be done with this one it'll be nodding off into your cups of tea Oh, I really, yeah. Doesn't that look lovely? Just glittering away there on my neck. I really, I love this one. Mind you, I love the gold one too. I'm not going to try gold on with this, but gold I think would work equally well with the navy blue. So um, that's that one. So I know I haven't shown you this dress. This was one I picked up again in the next sale for 20 something pounds, very, very little money. And um, it was after I tried on the black one from um, Marks and Spencer, you know, that was really lovely, fitted very neatly. But you know, all their dresses are up in the kind of 39, 40 pound bracket, and this is like 23 pounds, and it's pure cotton. It's just a plain black dress. So, you know, you can dress it up however you like. I put the little pearl enhancer onto my own paper clip necklace and I put on the long earrings. Now, I don't, you know, I don't know if this is going to work, so I'm just trying. But because these are long, I thought I might see how it looks with the um, gold and pearl lariat. And because um, I really do like that layering thing. Whenever I see it on other people, I think, oh, that looks nice. So I'll have a bit of that. You do feel a bit nervous pulling these down, I have to say. Well, I do. Oh, 
I think if I'm going to wear that, I think I don't need this pearl on here. I think it's jarring the look as it goes down. And actually, I don't think that works either with the um, delicate nature of the, the lariat necklace. So I'm going to take that off. Now, I quite like that. I do like this, you know, where they come over the dress. You could just place that exactly kind of there. So I think that looks quite nice. I mean, the only other, you know, I don't want to like gild the lilies, whatever they say. Or, you know, like what was it Chanel said? Coco Chanel. Put it all on and then take one thing off before you go out the front door. Didn't mean your knickers. What? It's more haste, less speed with these things. I'm trying to get a wiggle on because I don't want you all turning off. But I think I will do it in two parts because this, this video is already about 20 minutes long. I'll see. That looks better, doesn't it? With the delicate and delicate. And then if I did that, I would take that just a little bit lower so wrong shoes i know it's the wrong shoes but i honestly can't be doing the shoes as well i probably wear black shoes with this black sandals i've got a fair fair few choices but you know this is this is just a really handy black dress it's like the sleeves are comfortable it's pure cotton it's got a cotton lining I hope. Has it got a cotton lining or is it completely see-through? Oh no, it's just, no, it hasn't got a lining so I won't walk in front of the door, you'll see everything. Um, so, yeah, I, I like that combo. Or maybe, I'm just going to, crikey, I'm just going to do one last thing. She says. Trying to be quick and being slower. Um, I'll pop these little studs in actually. These are like little um, seed pearl studs, which basically means that they're, they're like not um, symmetrical. Do they, now they look, mm, they look better, don't they? They look neater. It's amazing isn't it what a difference it makes yeah now i'm liking that combination i love the way this sparkles this gold chain well, it's gold um gold plate on sterling silver bag so i mean you know this this dress could literally take you anywhere um with flat sandals it would look completely different so, um, yeah, I'll leave that one there because otherwise I'm going to be here till the cruise is over and done with. Um, thanks. So I'm put, trying to put something on first to save you being bored to death. So this is that Oliver Bonus um, dress that I bought in the next sale that's got the kind of coral colour running through it. So I just thought that this smoky quartz, um, I think that's what it is. I can imagine Corinne and Maneer when they watch this, they're going to be shouting at the screen whatever you know whatever they're looking at um laptop or whatever so um i put it on with these because it's these or the hoops are all i've got downstairs with me but i i do think that the the brown of the quartz looks lovely with the um brown of the dress it's not a color i normally wear um but i have got some lovely um espadrilles that i would wear with this so oh they look better don't they because funnily enough although they're bigger they're kind of more delicate because they're um thinner and they kind of disappear into my hair more so um i'll go with the gold i think you know brown and, and coral kind of definitely goes with gold doesn't it so that's um, 
this dress. I would wear this with espadrilles, not with a, a kind of a dressy shoe like this. This is the one that's got the flap. Again, it's pure cotton, so it's lovely and cool. And very